everyone, Chris Grandy. Just had a delicious meal at my favorite place, uh, Loading Dock, my favorite new Belmont place. And I thought I would share with you guys today the number one planning mistake I see with trusts. And it's not what you're probably thinking. You're probably thinking something about how the language is or, or, or uh, you know, who you left it to and things like that. No, number one problem we see in the office, okay, is people don't fund the trust. The attorney did a great job drafting a beautiful document, follows all your wishes, exactly what you want, beneficiaries, what you want it to be, everything's perfect. But five years later, there's still no assets in the trust. You didn't retitle your, your investment accounts, the house deed hasn't been titled to the trust, you haven't, done any, you haven't funded it. Now maybe that could have been the original attorney's fault, could have been whoever, but uh, for the most part, it really lies with you. You should have done that. And um, so, if you are in that situation, you haven't funded your account yet, make sure you go see your advisor. It's very easy to retitle assets to the name of a trust. And it's also pretty easy for your attorney to, to deed the house to the trust if that was your original goal. So make sure you check your trust, make sure you're the, it's funded the way you want it to be. And uh, I guess it's very important to have a, as much, have a legal checkup every few years as, as it is you visit your financial advisor. So if, uh, make sure they're part of the same team. Might be helpful to you. Hope that's a helpful hint. Any questions, let me know. Thanks for watching.